Hi, my name is Isabel Rinaldi and I'm a Senior Research Associate with QVC Diagnostics. Today, I'd like to give you a brief demonstration of the QVC Synthetic Control Mixing Protocol. Based upon feedback from early beta test evaluators, we found that testers had trouble mixing the synthetic control. This training video is to clarify issues occurring while mixing the control. You will need the following items. From your beta test kit, you will need a vial of QVC synthetic control, an AccuTube with float enclosure, and a QVC pipetter with AccuTube spacer. You will also require the proper personal protective equipment, a tissue or Kim wipe, a QVC centrifuge, and a QVC artery plus with printer. There are two parts to the mixing protocol. In the first step, the control should be shaken vigorously for approximately three to five seconds. Since it is made of synthetic components, the control can be shaken much harder than a whole blood sample. The second step involves a brisk inversion for no more than 30 seconds. Again, it's very important to vigorously shake the vial for three to five seconds to achieve proper results. Once complete, immediately begin the brisk inversion of the vial for 30 seconds. During this step, the vial must be completely inverted, allowing the control to run down the sides of the vial repeatedly. It is important to make sure that this step is done briskly, since slower inversion will not provide adequate mixing and will yield poor results. Also note that mixing longer than 30 seconds will cause results to be out of range. Once mixed thoroughly, open the vial and use your QVC pipetter with the AccuTube spacer to place the AccuTube approximately one-third to one-half the way into the vial with the plunger depressed. Slowly release the plunger and draw the synthetic control into the AccuTube. After taking the tube from the vial, remove it from the pipetter and wipe the AccuTube down. Be careful not to wick any of the control out of the AccuTube. Rock the AccuTube back and forth at least five times end to end, allowing the synthetic control to mix well with the orange coating. Turn the AccuTube upright and press firmly down on the countertop, seating the closure. Finally, Add a float to the top of the AccuTube. Now, place the tube into your QVC centrifuge for the five minute centrifugation. Once the centrifugation is complete, place your tube in the QVC Auto Read Plus, making sure that the Auto Read Plus is in CVC mode, not control mode. If done correctly, the synthetic control will yield the correct values found on your assay sheet if it does not, please repeat this procedure one more time using the same vial. After two failures, please open a new vial and test again. This concludes the QVC Synthetic Control Mixing Demonstration. If you have any questions, please contact the R&D department.